So the whole story of a dog's purpose started with the fact that this woman sitting next to me didn't have a dog when she was growing up. She got a dog when she was an adult. And I wasn't your wife, I and was your girlfriend. She was my girlfriend, <laughs> and, uh, and then the dog died unexpectedly. It was the first dog I ever had, and I said, I'm never gonna have another dog. Uh, I was trying to think of a way to comfort her, and we were on this long car ride. We were driving up the coast, and wow. I was thinking of trying to tell her a story because I'm a storyteller and that's how I help people and I told And he starts them. talking, he starts telling me this story that really is the story of a dog's purpose and it, he, he just starts spinning it out, this tale. He talked for an hour and a half. He told me basically the whole story of the book. I laughed because a bunch of it's really funny and then I was crying. I was, I was pretty much in tears by the end. And what was really different about this than, than any other novel I've ever written is that it came into my head as if I had downloaded it from somewhere. Normally when I write a book, I write a little bit, I stop, that didn't work, I throw it away. It was away. amazing, he was driving and yet he talked for an hour and a half and he told me this story and I said, you're gonna write that as a book and it's gonna be a classic. She liked the story so much she married me. <laughs>